Hey students, it's Mr. Young, and today we have a punting activity challenge. So I have three baskets, a one-point basket, a two-point basket, and here's a three-point basket. So obviously the one-point is closest, that's going to be easiest. Middle is two, and back is three. Another way you could set this up, if you don't have three baskets, maybe you just have a box or one basket at home. You could also use a cereal box. So what I'm doing is I'm marking off lines on the floor, one, two, and the farthest back, that's the three-point line. Now, this is a great activity to practice your foot eye control. And what you're going to do is you're going to make a ball using plastic bags. You could also maybe use a t-shirt or a sock and make a ball. Get creative here. Use different objects. But we want it to be light and something that's not going to harm anything if we kick it in our house. Obviously, the winter weather is coming and it's getting colder outside. So this is an activity that you can use if it's raining or snowing to practice your punting. All I'm doing is I'm holding that ball and I'm not tossing it in the air. I'm holding it, stepping it, and kicking. Oh, so close to a two-pointer there. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying. That's the important part because the more I try, the more practice I get and the better I become. And this is gonna be really important, students. You wanna have a flat foot so that you're more likely to make it. Like I just made a two-pointer. And now my partner and I, we're going back and forth if I'm playing with a partner. And it's a race to see who can score 10 points first. So my partner's got 10 point, or two points. I keep trying. I still have zero. Let's speed this up a bit. As you can see, it takes lots of tries, and I get lots of movement and steps in doing this activity. Okay, my partner's up. They step, drop, kick. Three-pointer! So now it's three to two, and we would keep playing until one person scores 10 points first. Have fun doing this activity. It is super fun and a great way to work on your foot control.